Hey everyone, this is Hodges1455. Wanting to wish everyone a happy 4th of July today. Hope you're having a good time. Enjoying the holiday. Wanting to look at some 1973 Topps cards. I was able to pick up at my local card shop a few weeks back. This is uh, Hank Aaron. There's the back. There's another Hank Aaron from the set. And a Lou Brock. Frank Robinson. Most of these are all Hall of Famers. But whenever one speaks to me that's not a Hall of Famer, I will pick that up too. There's the Al K line. Really enjoy the picture of this K line card. The rest of these are all out of the dollar box. Another K-Line card. Just couldn't pass it up. A little chewed up there, but the picture and everything, the coloring on it was just great. It's a Fergie Jenkins. And a Juan Marichal. And a home runs leaders. So since this is the 73 tops, it's showing the 1972 home run leaders. Johnny Bench and Dick Allen. Dick Allen's not yet a Hall of Famer, but hopefully one day he will be. We also had the 72 batting leaders. Card, Billy Williams and Rod Carew. And another Billy Williams. A Jim Cott. Don't see very many cards of pitchers hitting, at least back in the day. That's kind of cool. And the last card is not a Hall of Famer, but hopefully one day will be Mickey Lolich. Just an outstanding pitcher, great career. This is a 73 tops. In 72, he finished third in Cy Young. 71, he finished second of Vita Blue. Um, 71, I believe he also he started 45 games. And I believe he threw 29 complete games. Faced like over 1,500 batters, which is just crazy in today's terms. I, I think Garrett Cole's most he's ever faced is 849. Just for a point of reference, just really cool. He's also won the 68 World Series with the Tigers and was the World Series MVP that year. Well, thanks for watching. Enjoy the hobby.